What's happening guys, Ramadan Training and Nutrition EP1, episode 1, the first episode. Um, quickly before I talk about the actual topic, I'm going to quickly mention that I'm going to go help out my friend today with a, um, some charity work. We're going to be donating a lot of stuff to his local masjid um, that's going to be cargoed over to Syria. And I'll show you some of the stuff on the screen if I can. And yeah, the reason why I'm mentioning this is because getting all your good deeds guys it's ramadan you should be helping the people less fortunate whenever you can regardless but it's ramadan your good deeds are only going to benefit you even more and you're going to get rewarded and praised even more with that being said guys i'm going to carry on with the rest of the video i'm going to show you guys what i'm eating throughout the day why i'm eating it maybe show some of the macronutrient breakdown of, of what i'm eating also i won't be able to train later on in the gym because by the time i'm finished doing everything i'm going to be um the gym's going to be closed tired also so i might do a little small little workout in my shed if i can film that i'll film that too put that on the screen that way show you guys there's no excuses even a small little workout is better than no workout with that being said let's move to the next clip all right guys so as you can see i just got the stuff placed out i'm just prepping the food for iftar i got four Shazan beef burgers over here. I bought three. I'm gonna cook three today. I'm gonna to have two for myself, one for my mom. There's the macros. I'm also gonna put the macros on the screen. I weighed out the sweet potato fries earlier. I'm gonna put a bit of salt and pepper and chuck that in the oven. Got some peri peri wings and some frozen corn on the cob also. I'm just frying up some burgers for my sister because she prefers the processed burgers. Alright guys, make sure you have some self-control because I've got enough carbs for the whole of Ramadan in this box and I'm not going to have it in this one meal. And also I've got leftover dono kebab and stuff like that that my uncle brought over from yesterday Which I'm not going to have Preheated the oven to 220 I'm just going to quickly put the sweet potatoes in now Because the sweet potatoes take longer to cook than the other dishes I'm going to chuck it in first ah, Burgers just got planted in also guys I'm just putting the sweet corn in the microwave It normally takes about um, six minutes to cook from frozen in the microwave but I'm gonna cook it for about three minutes or three and a half minutes and I'm gonna put it in the oven and hopefully it turns out more crispier all right guys see I've got a tall glass of water right here and three kazoors over here as well I always break my fast with three kazoors get some simple carbs in me Alright guys Make sure you're hydrated. Yeah, I just took the food out of the oven. The burgers are well done. That's how I like it. The corn and the cobs, they're cooked. I'm gonna have one for myself. Again, two of these are for me and one is for my mom. I'm gonna be sure to chuck on some extra mature cheese onto the burger as well. Just finishing putting the burger together. I just put some caramelized onions on there. As you can see, my plate has the wings and sweet potatoes and also the burger on top i'm about to put some ketchup on top of the burger as well i'm not going to check how much i'm putting but i know it's under one serving which is 15 grams which is less than 15 calories so i'm just going to tuck into this now for my first meal i forgot to put the corn on the cob on the plate i just bit the burger as well Welcome to my playground guys As you can see this is where I will be training So the plan is to start off with the treadmill 
Then I'm gonna go over to here to the pull up bar. I just finished the session in the shed. I'm gonna put on the screen um, what I trained because the camera actually died on me, so I do apologize and quickly explain. I basically done uh, 20 minutes of cardio followed by three sets of pull ups, three sets of chin ups, and also upper abs four sets and lower abs four sets. And that's all, it all consisted of about 35, 40 minute workout at most. So it was a quick little session, got that done. It should be on the screen for you guys to see. Any small little workout is better than no workout, guys. Remember that. What's good, guys? Um, I just dried myself after a nice little bath. And I just wanted to thank you guys all for watching the video. Ah, I'm still cutting down, still trying to lose weight. I'm going to try and put up the daily total net calories that I had today in the corner somewhere. Um, I also did have three more kezurs, uh, kezurs, sorry. Um, afterwards and I also had a protein smoothie um, with fruits and skimmed milk so I'm going to put the total net calories up here somewhere right now and yeah so you roughly you guys have an idea of what I had um, you saw the little training session in the shed I'm just going to close the video off right now and I'm going to see you in the next video peace hey actually Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Love you all. Peace.